Hi, this is Virgo the Oracle. I'm here to do a reading for Virgo. Hey Virgo, how are you? Let's tap into this energy. Spirit come through. What messages do you have for Virgo? Sun, moon, and rising. Okay. All right. Spirit come through. Can I have some messages for Virgo? Please remember to like, share, and subscribe. Okay. If this resonates, hit that like button. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much for joining me. Thank you for all your beautiful comments, all your beautiful donations. Thank you for riding with me. Spirit come through. Can I have some messages for Virgo? What's going on with Virgo? What's been happening? Can I have some messages for Virgo? Mm -hmm. Virgo, come through spirit. Let me get some energy. Let me tap into this energy. First position is high priestess energy. Lord, first position out the gate. What? All right. The nine of cups. The magician. Okay, Virgo. You got the ace of coins. Okay. You have the ten of cups. All right. Okay. You have justice. Look at that. All right. You got the seven of coins. Mm -hmm. You got the six of wands. Okay. Mm -hmm. Two of wands. Okay. All right. You also have the nine of wands. Ay, ay, ay. You have the queen of swords. And you have the knight of cups. Okay. Not bad. Beautiful spread. Beautiful. Beautiful spread. Okay, where's my wine? All right. Come through spirit. Mm-hmm. All right. So you have one, two, three. We'll take it. All right. We will take it. Spirit. Oh, at the bottom of the deck, you got four. You got the moon card, okay? Virgo, somebody's keeping secrets. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Someone is hiding their feelings from you. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Someone is in love with you, but they don't tell you. Mm, and this is causing you to give up. Lord, have mercy. You said, uh-uh. Yeah, you're ready to give up on this. Mm -hmm, you're losing faith. Yeah. You feel this situation is hopeless. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, yeah. You feel this connection just isn't working for you, okay? Because this person holds back. This person won't tell you how they feel. All right. They want a second chance with you, though. They're judging themselves. They want to do over. They want to see if they can repair this with you. Mm, but you don't want to work on this. You said enough is enough. Yeah. If you thought this person was cheating on you and had you in some sort of third party situation, they don't anymore or, or they won't. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's see what else we got. All right. First position, high priestess energy. Isn't that amazing with your little psychic selves, okay? Very intuitive energy, yeah. You guys are definitely starting to become a little bit more comfortable in your skin, you know, huh? You're, you're, you're getting more aware of what you can do when you're doing it, okay? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, you're becoming the best version of yourself, Virgo, with this high priestess energy in first position. You need some sort of stimulation, though. You're kind of bored, all right? Yeah, you guys are extremely intuitive, okay? Yeah, yeah. See, things around you are not what they seem right now. There's a lot that's yet to be revealed, but it will, okay? You're very intuitive energy. It's not much that can be hidden from you, you know, especially with, for those of you who knows how to tap into your energy and you're getting really good at it, okay? Yeah, there's a mystery about you, Virgo. Yeah, and it pulls a lot of people uh, towards you, a lot of people being interested in you. Yeah, some of you are craving for someone or something that you can't have to... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, but you also got a lot of people who want to gravitate to you, who want to hang around you, okay? Yeah, it's like they want to cling to you. They just, Be careful of these energy vampires, Virgo, because that's what it feels like to me, that people are just gravitating to you to, to try to, like, pull off your energy, pull on your energy or something like that. You got the Nine of Cups right here. My goodness, it don't get no better than that. It's one of the best cards we can get. Yeah, this is wish fulfillment that's coming in for you, Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, things are improving for you, Virgo. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. 
it's like your wishes is coming true. Your desires is definitely going to be be revealed here, okay? It's like this is meant to be. Yeah. You guys have a very strong intuition. You must use it or you're learning to use it or you're getting comfortable in using it. Yeah, you're going to be using it with this magician card right here, okay? Yeah. Because you're manifesting some sort of... Mm, you're manifesting a lot of stuff. It could be manifesting a reunion, manifesting um, a home, a new job, a promotion, uh, a vacation. You're just manifesting right now. Whatever it is that you're hoping for, you're going to get, okay? Yeah, because you're using your power now. You're tapping into your energy. Yeah, you're tapping into your full potential here, okay? You're no longer playing it small, all right? Yeah, and you have the tools. You're realizing that you have the tools to pull in whatever you want. This manifesting, this manifestation energy is, is this is your creative side. You're starting to create exactly what you want. Okay, yeah, and you're going to get the outcome that you want. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're very resourceful too, and people gravitate to you for that. It's like a lot of energy is coming towards you for what you can do. Okay, Virgo, you also got the Ace of Coins. It don't get no better than that. My God, this is a fine. This is financial prosperity coming your way this is a financial blessing coming your way okay yeah it's like the seeds that you have been planting are now about to sprout a huge harvest okay money is coming towards you okay a physically satisfying relationship is coming towards you and i say physically satisfying yeah because some of you are tired of the duds you've been getting some of you are tired of the you know they, they, they just don't measure up or some fuck shit like that but this is going to be especially physically okay this is going to be a physically physically satisfying relationship that you're manifesting okay yeah you're manifesting any and everything that you want right now look at this magician and the ace of coins this is new opportunity this is blessings you will reap what you sow okay you will re receive a huge harvest for all that you have been sending out to the universe okay mm-hmm mm-hmm yeah, it's like you're finally being blessed for all your hard work, for all your patience, okay? Yeah, mm, 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 mm. it don't get no better than that. Yeah, uh, some of you are about to be settling down with someone too, very soon, yeah. Especially for those of you who are single, okay? Because this is love and support coming in for you. Yeah, you're going to be settling down very soon, okay? Yeah, justice, cause and effect. Whatever you've been sending out to the universe, you're about to get it back. You're about to be rewarded here, okay? The universe is rewarding you for all your for all that you have tolerated, for all the injustice that you have tolerated. Yeah, this is this was a great deal of injustice. The universe saw it all. The universe is about to balance all of these things for you too. Yeah, this is a great deal of fairness coming in for you. Okay? With this justice card. For those of you that's married, you might be heading for a divorce. Okay? For those of you who's not married, you might hear of a divorce. Okay? Could be dealing with a Libra here as well. Okay? Uh-huh. Yeah, you could be dealing with a Gemini. You could be dealing with another ear, another Earth sign, Taurus, Capricorn, or another Virgo. Yeah, Pisces, Scorpio. What is that? Pisces, Scorpio, or a Cancer. Okay, you've been working very hard, Virgo. Very hard. And you're getting the recognition that you deserve. Somebody is seeing you. They see you. They see what you can do. They see how well you do it. You've been working very hard. Okay, you're getting a lot of recognition. Okay, you're getting a lot of attention, okay? Yeah, you're getting a lot of accolades, a lot of applause, okay? People are happy for you. They're proud of you. They see how good you are or something like that. Virgo, you got a decision to make, too. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But just two of wands. You do have a decision to make. Yeah, you're going to have to... This is going to be a very important decision, okay? Are you going to continue to to uh, stay with this draining-ass energy or are you going to move on? Because you have a very draining-ass energy around you. You know you need to let it go, but you're still holding on to it for whatever reason. You might be holding on to it and craving for something that you can't have or something that you shouldn't have. Uh -huh. That's normally the high priestess energy. That's wanting something that they can't have or wanting something or craving for something that they can't have or they shouldn't have okay yeah you might be holding on to that type of energy here it's very draining and you know you need to let it go but you love them so you're still holding on to it yeah you're kind of cold to them though yeah yeah it's like you want some truth you want to know more about this situation you want to know more you want this person to speak up more and tell you something okay you may feel that this person wants you you may feel that this person loves you you may feel that you have something with this person but like at the bottom of the deck they just not they're not they're not putting in they're not putting enough in for you and you're ready to give up okay yeah but you're still holding on because you know that something 
is here. Okay, something you feel something with this person, you know, they feel something with you. They just don't speak up. They don't tell you nothing. And you want some truth. You want to know this person rushes in to tell you how they feel about you. They're going to rush in to tell you how they feel about you, though. You're going to get it. Okay, you're going to get some sort of uh, message or some sort of something is going to be revealed here. Okay, something is coming out. And it's basically about how this person feels for you. Okay, they may come a little too late. They may come when this new relationship comes in for you because this is love coming in for you. This is a new physically uh, satisfying relationship, okay? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Could very much be this person who wants to come and tell you how they feel, but this looks like you're about to have some sort of intimate relationship with someone, okay? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You're manifesting it. You want more of it, yeah. Yeah, many of you who's lonely, you're very tired of being lonely, you're sick of it. And this is what you're manifesting. You're manifesting a, a long-term relationship. You lo you're manifesting longevity. You want it. You want somebody stable, okay? And you want someone to satisfy you, okay? You're getting bored. You're a little bored. Let's pull some clarifiers and see what else we can get, Virgo, okay? Yeah, some of you are just a little bored with this energy. You're like, uh-uh, something got to give. I'm tired of this. Not to worry, it will. Spirit come through. Can I have some messages? Let's look at the guardian angels. See what they have for you. Let's check with the angels. Let's check with the angels. Spirit come through. We have angel of new beginnings. 22 at the top. Virgo, some of you have a birthday. Uh... This September the 22nd, okay? You got some new beginnings coming in for you, Virgo. Yeah. Your angels is guiding guiding this new beginning for to you, too. They've been watching you and protecting you, okay? They know that you've been praying or manifesting a new beginning, a fresh start. And here it is. You're on the brink of it. You are on the brink of a spirit come through. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah. Some of you are very sad, okay? Your angels are comforting you. You cry a lot. You're just unhappy. You have everything that you want, but it's one particular thing that that brings sadness to you. You may be feeling alone. You may be feeling sad. Uh huh. Your angels are comforting you on that, okay? You could have a birthday September the sixth, okay? Yeah, something that something has your heart heavy, okay? Don't worry about it, Virgo. Your, your angels are definitely going to guide you through that, okay? Yeah, we also have happiness, okay? The angels are sending you a great deal of happiness. They want you guys to be happy. Somebody's been sad and unhappy too long or has been sad and unhappy too long, all right? Yeah, raise your vibration. It's time for you to get out of this, okay? Your dreams are coming true. Your angels are making sure of this. Many of you have a birthday that's on September the 10th, the 6th. And the 15th, okay? Or the 22nd, all right? If your birthday falls on that, pay it close attention to this read, okay? Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You also have angel of love. Some of you want love in the worst way, and it's coming. The angels is definitely sending the right person to you to love, okay? You can have a birthday on September the 12th. I mean, September ooh, the 12th, too, because it's not a pay, but the 12th came out. So you could have a birthday September the 12th. But this is September the 20th, okay? You definitely have uh, love coming in for you, hot and heavy, all right? Those of you been praying for it, you've been crying over it, you've just been longing for someone to love you, okay? Somebody's very, very lonely. All right, not to worry. Love is coming in for you. Don't give up. You're going to get the outcome that you want. All right? Do not worry about that. I see somebody's doing a great deal of worrying about that. Okay? Spirit, come through. Can I have some more messages, please? Yeah, we got new moon in Leo. It's time for you to shine, Virgo. It's time for you to shine. And this is exactly what you're doing. Okay? This is exactly what you're doing. Okay? Mm hmm Yeah. You're becoming the best version of yourself right now. You're stepping into your power. Your higher self is taking over. Okay? Going through some sort of transformation here. Okay, we got unleash your kindness self. Okay, full full quarter moon in Capricorn. Yeah, some of you have to be a little bit. Be, you have to be a little bit more kinder, not only to others but to yourself as well. Okay, it's time to unleash that kindness. 
that kind energy that you that you hold. You do have it. Yeah, you're just angry right now. You're angry at the universe. You're angry at everything because it's not going your way. Embrace the flow of life. Full moon in Gemini. You can't get frustrated when things don't go your way. You have to be a little bit more patient. And I know you say, good Lord, how much more patience can I exude, okay? Just know like you know like you know you're on this journey for a reason. You're going to get the outcome that you want. And I see most of you are really lonely. You want somebody to share your accolades with, okay? You do very good financially. You do very well uh, career-wise. Your children is good. You're good. You just want somebody to love. Yeah, work through your feelings, full moon and Aries. Yeah, you got a lot of love to give. Yeah. Yeah, you're in your feelings right now, Virgo. Not to worry. You're going to get the outcome that you want. The person that you want wants you. They're coming in for you. You're going to meet them. Just prepare yourself for them, okay? Focus on the positive. Stay positive. New moon is Sagittarius, okay? Stay positive. Focus on the positivity. You guys are in a really good energy. Do not stain it. Don't ruin it with this with this uh with this yearning and this longing for somebody to come and be with you or for somebody to come and love you. Know like you know like you know that the universe is bringing the right person to you, okay? Let's see what else is going on. Spirit come through. Can I have some more messages, please? Come through. Can I have some more messages, please? For Virgo. Mm -hmm. Virgo, you're clearly dealing with a Libra. Some of you are clearly dealing with a Libra. You have Libra in your chart. Okay. Not to worry. Balance will be restored here. Okay. The universe is going to give you which, all that you have been sending out. Okay. And all the good that you have been sending out, you're about to be rewarded for that. Okay. I can't make this shit up. I swear on everything. A great deal of abundance is coming your way. And like I said, some of you already have abundance. And you're like, I don't need that. I need love. <laughs> I don't want more of that. Of course you want more of that. Don't ever turn that down. Uh-huh. Yeah, some of you are dealing with a Sagittarius. Okay. Uh-huh. Some of you may have Sagittarius in your chart. So you got a Libra or Sagittarius that's definitely trying to get to you, Virgo. They might be giving you a hard way to go. They might make you feel like they don't want you. They're not into you. But it's about to all be revealed how they truly feel about you, okay? Yeah, it might be some sort of fuckboy energy you're dealing with. Some sort of fuck girl energy that you're dealing with. But not to worry. Mm -hmm. You're about to get what you want. I want you. I want us, okay? Uh -huh. You won't be long. You won't be. You won't be lonely long. Somebody's love sick as hell. Somebody needs to snap out of that love sick energy. Get out that fetal position. Go take you a shower. Put some clothes on. Go get you something. To, go get something to air and go get something to eat. Lord, come on, step out. Snap out of it. That's not the energy to be in. Send that shit to the other person. Okay. You snap out of that. Anybody got time? Move in silence. Stop telling all your damn business too, okay? Uh-huh. I'm talking to you, Virgo. I'm talking to you. All right. Somebody's definitely in their feelings. You're so gorgeous. Hey, gorgeous. Step on out of it. Snap out of it. Snap out of it. Okay? Don't believe the lies that you're telling yourself. Okay? You're not good enough. You're not smart. Why can't you be fulfilling enough for this person? Why can't this person want you the way you want them? What is it about this other person that they keep going to? Let them get their damn karma from their karmic and let them stay there. Okay? Nobody, I mean, I know you might love this person and you crave for them, but let them stay there because you're blocking your own blessing. You're on a spiritual journey right here and every area in your life is doing great. But this area, yeah, you're still waiting for someone to come and tell you how they feel or come and tell you that they want you back. If they don't come to hell with them, third party situation, uh-uh. No, 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 no more play. They want to get you. They want to come out of that. We saw that. If somebody had you in a third party situation, they're definitely going to come out of that. Okay. All right. Yeah, it's you that, you know, are doubting their actions. It's you who's ready to walk away. Okay, if this person is with somebody else, they sleep on the couch. They don't even have intimacy with that person, okay? All right? Yeah, don't stress out. You're stressed about this person. You love them so much and you want them so bad. Uh-huh. Yeah, come on now. That's going to damage you. All right? Some of you are damaged by this person or you're dealing with a damaged ass energy. Uh-uh. Don't let that hold you back. Don't let that stop you, okay? Spirit come through. You got shit to do. You know you do. Uh, 
Yeah. yeah. Whoever you're dealing with needs to take back their power. Okay. They're very weak. They're not as strong as you. Okay. You have to be a little patient with, with whoever this person is that you're dealing with. Okay. And I'm really talking to my female energies when I say that. Okay. Virgo females. Whoever you guys are dealing with, they're not as strong as you. They got to take back their power. Okay. We got Wheel of Fortune. All right. You know the universe is about to bless you, right? All right. The, the universe is definitely about to give you your heart's desire. If you could just be a little bit patient, okay? We have the Wheel of Fortune and the Sun. It don't get no better than that. Mm, 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 mm. Spirit come through. Yeah. Your luck is changing, all right? You got the Wheel of Fortune and the Sun. All right, your luck is changing. Everything you touch is you got you got the Midas touch. Everything you touch is going to turn to gold. Everything is improving for you. Something is coming in for you. The chariot is moving fast towards you. Let things happen organically. Get busy. Concentrate on other stuff. Not your loneliness. Not this individual here who's not taking control because they will. We have the emperor. Okay. The emperor will come towards you. This is a very stable individual, very reliable individual, okay? This is a protector, okay? This person might be with somebody else who has full control of them right now, okay? High priestess energy. Some of you already know that, okay? Some of you are in love with somebody that's with somebody else, okay? And their hands is tied. They don't know what to do, all right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But they don't want to lose you. We have uh, some sort of... Uh, Reconciliation coming in. This person wants to restore whatever you guys had. You might have cut it off with this person. You got tired of waiting for them. But you can't move on at the same time. Yeah, you have some sort of addiction to this person. All right? Somebody has some sort of addiction. Uh -huh. The addiction to sex, drinking, drugs. Somebody needs to, uh, you know, get away out of, get out of that toxicity. Okay? Some so Somebody's in a very toxic... They have some sort of toxic... Uh, could, uh, attachment, okay? Yeah, Empress Energy. Some of you are very, very, very intuitive. Uh huh. This person has a lot of respect for you, too. It's a strong bond that you hold with this person, whoever this person is, okay? You might be trying to get away from this person. You might have already walked away from this person, but you're going to get the outcome that you want, okay? Yeah, you guys want somebody to love you. You got the star card. You want attention. Okay, you're not losing hope. You want to heal. You're, you're trying to pull in somebody to be yours, okay? You want your own. You want your own romance, your own love. And this is what you're manifesting, okay? But not to worry. It's already in the works, okay? It has already begun. Nothing else to be done. What you want wants you, okay? Whoever this is that you're craving for, whoever's on your mind, whoever stresses you out, okay? Whoever who has been really working your nerves to this for this commitment that you want, you're going to get it, okay? You might be dealing with a very damaged energy, okay? This person might be very damaged, okay? They might be coming walking away from a very toxic situation, okay? But a whole new world is coming in for you. A whole new energy was coming in. Um, with this person, okay? Just be patient, all right? And if you can't be patient, move on. Don't stay stuck because you got stuff to do. You, you're doing so good otherwise, all right? You're doing so good otherwise, Virgo. Don't let this ruin anything for you, okay? If this person is not ready, this person don't want you, keep it moving, all right? Because you got so many others that want you, but you, I, I, you guys are fixated on one particular person, okay? Or well, this one particular person is fixated on you, the energy can go, can go both ways, okay? Yeah, we got take a ch taking a chance. Somebody's going to take a chance here, all right, and come towards you. You may make this person very nervous or something like that. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah, somebody's also in denial about their feelings for you. Somebody's not being truthful to themselves. Ay, ay, ay. Your person could very much be in denial here, okay? Whoever they're with could be in denial that their relationship is over. Somebody's in denial here. Somebody's with a very toxic lover, being taken advantage of, walked over, no control, possessive and jealous, okay? Mm -hmm. All right. 
Yeah, we got stability, lack of stability. This person might be losing money, whoever you're, whoever you're craving for, whoever you're thinking about, whoever this person is that's holding back from you. They're holding back from you because they have to get out of another situation that's just not healthy at all, okay? It's very toxic, all right? All right? Leave, leave it right where it is, okay? Shady-ass energy they're with. Leave it right where it is. Leave them with that shady-ass person. All right, they could be married. Leave them right there in that shady ass marriage. Okay, leave them there. All right, somebody's about to be busted. The truth is about to come out. Okay, if this person is in love with you, that spouse is about to find out. The truth is all about to be revealed. Okay, uh huh, uh huh, yeah. It's time, okay? Waiting for the right time. Impatient and antsy. Some of you are very impatient and you're fed up. This is why you walked away from this person. Now this person wants to talk. They want to chit-chat with you. This person want to take you out to dinner or drink so for some wine or something. Okay, you're going to be celebrating something soon, Virgo. Yeah. You got some sort of surprise, some sort of proposal, some sort of event, okay? Uh huh. Yeah, you're getting very impatient here. You're tired of waiting for this person to shit to get off the pot. Yeah, but you gotta let them get their karma. All right. You can't get in the way of this person's karma. This person may even have to get karma because of you. We got betrayal. This person could have betrayed you. Okay. We also got that's the that's the thesis. Okay. Yeah. Let this unfold organically. All right. Because actually, your energy is great. You're doing great. Okay. Yeah. You're definitely becoming the best version of yourself, okay? You have a lot of envy. You got a lot of envy, uh, Virgo. Lots of envy. Someone is very envious of you, very jealous of you, okay? That always comes up. It's your strength. A lot of people envy your strength, your know-how, your abilities to keep it moving, okay? Uh-huh. Yeah. Somebody's watching you, too. That creepy-ass eyeball. Somebody's definitely keeping some sort of tabs on you. Yeah. Somebody's watching every move you make. You're, they, ooh, baby, this is why. This is why. They want to know how you get your money, how you make it. What you what you be doing? Okay? What do you do for a living? All right? They want to know how you living, okay? Yeah. Because you get it like you live it. Uh-huh. We got the mask. Somebody's not being honest, Okay? Yeah, what you think about this person and their spouse or their relationship is not what you think, okay? They're losing money. They're arguing. They're not happy. They don't even sleep in the same bed, okay? Some of you are going to win or you are winning some sort of lawsuit here. There's going to be some sort of disturbance here, all right? We got disputes, exposure, drama, unexpected changes, okay? Yeah. The changes that's coming in for you is the changes that you need, okay? It's a part of the journey, all right? Mm-hmm. Spirit, come through. Can I have some more messages, please? Mm. Well, some of you is about to get a new job. Uh huh. You got the job. You've been circulating your resume. Some people are uh, gossiping about you too, Virgo. Somebody's all in your business. Or they want to get all in your business. Some of you are entrepreneurs. You do your own thing. Okay? You have your own business and it's doing very good. Okay? You might be hiring people. All right? Uh -huh. Some of you got a sugar daddy coming in for you. Somebody wants to take care of you. Could be an older gentleman. All right. You could be the older gentleman to this to the younger girl. However, it fits for you. Okay. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah, we have witchcraft. Someone is casting spells. Okay. Somebody might have been trying to stop you or block you. Okay. Uh -huh. Yeah. Somebody was definitely trying to block you obstacles. Okay. Yeah. Uh -huh. Could have been some sort of fake coworker. All right. Somebody that you worked with, okay? But they can't bust a grape. They're not blocking nothing. Don't worry about nothing. You're fine there, okay? They're just trying. You got all these uh, kitchen witches trying stuff. They don't do nothing but sabotage their own blessing. Spirit, come through. Can I have some more messages, please? Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. What's the time? Right, we're doing good. What's the time? Yeah, Virgo, you're definitely becoming the best version of yourself. You can't stop now. And I know you want this person that's on your heart. Somebody's heavy on your heart. Okay? But leave them where they're staying because you cannot block your blessing. 
some huge rewards is coming in for you. Huge. You, you, you can't let this person hinder you any longer, okay? For some of you, this is not for all of you. Some of you are comfortable in your skin and you and you're gone. You you done took off already. Shit, and they they you they gotta catch up with you. We have electric witch, okay, pave your own path. You're not lost, you're just different, okay? Yeah, you stand out from a crowd. Yeah. Like I said, some of you are have this you have this mystery about you that's very intriguing. To grab, a lot of people gravitate to you for it. We got angels, okay? Your angels are guiding you. You're not alone on this journey, yeah. If you're feeling alone, you know, lonely, you want somebody to share life with, you want somebody to love, you want somebody to grow old with, you just want somebody to be with, you want to have sex, you want to make love, that is coming, okay? You're manifesting it. All right, just watch your energy because if it gets desperate, you're going to interfere with it coming. Okay, you can't you can't long for it or manifest it in that desperate energy. You're going to sabotage it. Just relax. Okay, we have graveyard. Okay, step through to a new life, coming near the end of a chapter. Okay, a new you is is emerging. All right. A whole new you is emerging. Let it emerge, okay? Many of you are saying all the time, the old me is dead. I'm not the same person I used to be, okay? If you're using those words, you know, live it. Don't just say it. Live it, okay? You have black salt, okay? There's no existing blockages. You're protected from all harm. See, nobody can't do shit to you. They're trying to block you. They're trying to stop your success, all right? Because they think that you're going to get more than them or something like that. You might be going for the same promotion or... or the same accolades or something like that. This person wants to get it. Some of you are about to take an exam. You're about to take a test. You're stressing out over it. No, don't. You will pass it. Flying colors, okay? Mm -hmm. We have the egg, okay? Rid yourself of negative people. You're absorbing other people's energy. This is why I say you must clean your energy, okay? Sage your home at least twice a week. Continue to take your salt, your uh, sea salt baths, okay? We have the skull. A scattered mind is powerless. Feed your mind positive thoughts, okay? Yeah, get away from that negative energy because it's messing with your positive thoughts, okay? We also have spell jar, okay? Don't keep things bottled up. Unleash the power within you, okay? And, and you're not. You're using your tools. You're manifesting what you want. But some of you, what you want, you're just not getting. And what you want is this individual that you love so much. Or any individual at this point. You just want somebody to call your own. All right? And you're going to get it. We have cowries, okay? This is a creative period for you. New ideas could bring prosperity, okay? Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Change your attitude. Change your thinking. Watch that stinking thinking because it sabotage you, okay? It'll block you for what you really want. And what you really want is someone to call your own. Some of you have been alone for far too long. And you're giving up hope that you will ever find love, okay? Uh-uh. That's that stinking thinking. Uh-uh. Some of you got to act like already. Act like you got somebody, you know? Get up. Get dressed. Go out. Have fun. Live. So you can raise that vibration and pull in what you want. Okay. You definitely have to sage your home. Purify your space and take time to pray. Ask for the help from your guides. Yeah. Ask for help from your guides. Okay. We got ritual bath. Jump into that spiritual bath. Take your baths. Take better care of yourself. Time for some self pampering. Okay. Now you can't walk around. Uh. Looking like, you know, you ain't looking for nobody, you know, put your clothes on. Stop walking around with them sweats on. Okay, your skin all dry. You ain't moisturizing. You ain't taking no salt bath. You're not, you're not doing anything to pamper yourself. You know, go get your, go get your massages. Go get your hair done. Look like you want to meet somebody, okay? Get it together now. We got Santiera, okay? Your sacrifices will be worth it. Sacrifices must be made to advance. Yeah. If you want to attract, go look attractive, okay? Mm -hmm. We got Wiccan Magic, okay? Work with the magical energies. Spell work will help you get ahead, okay? Now, if you're definitely manifesting what you want, be be a part of what you want. Exhibit it. Look it, okay? Like I said, if you want to attract, look very attractive, okay? If you want to attract the opposite sex, look attracting to that opposite sex, okay? If you want to attract more money, burn you some money candles, put money all around you, okay? We have drumming, okay? Connect with spirit through music. Use music to boost your energy. If you're feeling down and about, change. put some music when it's going to change that energy, okay? 
All right. We got voodoo magic. Okay. Events that change your life forever. Surprising life events will take place. Yeah. You're definitely going to get the outcome that you want, Virgo. Okay. Be mindful of that. Don't lose hope. Here it come. Get ready. Because here it come. You're manifesting. You're pulling it in. All right. Like I said, you guys are definitely hands down. You're definitely becoming the best version of yourself. Don't stop now. Okay. Don't don't stop now. Don't interfere with that. All right. Talk to you soon. I shall.